Well, hello everybody and um, welcome back to Mark's Allotment. It's the, hmm, it's Friday the 7th I think, something like that of December and it's very sunny but it's bitterly cold and we've been having some snow flurries. Anyway, uh, as crazy as it may sound, I've decided I'm going to try and put some slates on my shed today. Uh, whether I'll get it all done today, I don't know, but uh, anyway, let me just show you some uh, before shots and then hopefully some finished shots later. Anyway, I'm just going to turn the camera, turn the camera around. Hopefully you can hear me better now. Um, so, let me get out of this, so I'm pointing into the sun. So this, this is the shed I bought. Now, why uh, I said the size of, on my sorry on my previous video I said the shed was uh, 12 by 6 I don't know why I said 12 by 6 as my wife says you're always over exaggerating the size <laughs> um, anyway no it's an 8 by 6 8 foot by 6 foot well it's the metric equivalent 240 by whatever the, the other dimensions anyway uh, as I say, normally these retail at around about four to five hundred pound shiplap, which is the uh, if you don't know what shiplap, but that's what it looks like, rather than the feather edge, which is this side. This particular type of shed doesn't last very long; they're rubbish, really. And this is why I was looking, always looking for one of these. Anyway, um, say four, four or five hundred pound new got that for 150 pounds I was well chuffed and um, say now I've, from the previous video I put the uh, some flagstones down as a base and the intention is then I got some left over and uh, put some more around the outside edges maybe a greenhouse here so anyway just raise it up to see see the roof So that's the beginning shot and hopefully the next time you see it it'll be complete um, this is my old shed which obviously I'll dismantle and get rid of not quite sure what to do with it yet if it's some of it is salvageable I will salvage it but uh, it's all higgledy piggledy anyway all right bye for now Well, hello everybody and uh, welcome back to Mark's Allotment. Uh, uh, what day is it? We're Friday today. A uh, couple of days now before Christmas. So I just a uh, uh, quick update on the shed situation. So I've managed to... It's not quite finished. I've just got to put a bit of guttering on it. Then I'll turn it around and finish for you to see. So, dismantled the old shed. That's there. That'll, uh, most of that will be burnt because it's, the wood is just too uh, well. It's just rotten. So I've finished slating the, the shed. Um, actually, I'm, something I didn't check, which I should have done, of course, was if it could. Although they are these fibre slates, the um, uh, but the cement slates, they're still quite heavy. I should have checked the roof would take the weight, but. It took my weight, which is 14 stone, plus all those slates, so yeah, it's, it's doing all right. Um, yeah, I've got a few little bits to do. Some guttering to put on yet. Uh, but I've, hopefully it's weatherproof. Just check around the back, the back of it as well. But I think it's okay. Um, yeah, it should be all right. Anyway, I've, <coughs> I don't know if you can see this white sheet, but I've got a, um, a roof, a bit of profile roof sheeting, which I'm going to cut into two lengthways, and then that will uh, sit on top of the le on the ridge. I think, uh, I mean, I've got some uh, mastic type, um, what do they call it? 
damn course in there which is stuck to it and it seems to be holding so that should hopefully keep it weatherproof um, and we just shoved everything in here for the time being the old base of the, sh the base of the old shed that's still pretty sound so yeah I think um, that's doing okay so that's it anyway uh, sorry about a bit of jiggling around there yeah so I know they're gonna all laugh at me down here they see why am I putting all this slides on but I want this I'm hoping this shed will outlast me um, as long as I keep it weatherproofed and that should be fine so a very Merry Christmas to all of you and a Happy New Year and as I say in the new year I uh, will be the sort of start of see how these beds are performing as far as um, no dig system is concerned um, that's it anyway bye for now <laughs>